Today, we are going to be naming the ionic compound KClO. Now here's a trick, guys. If you see that you have a compound with three or more different elements, you know that you're dealing with at least one polyatomic ion. In this case, we do have three different elements. We have K for potassium, we have Cl for chlorine, and we have O for oxygen. Now just remember, polyatomics are never going to be on the periodic table. You have to memorize them. So I wrote down the polyatomic that we're going to see down here. All right, so just use flashcards if you're on this playlist with all ionic compounds. Make a, a list of all the polyatomics that we use, okay? And just try to memorize them. ClO always has a negative one charge, and this polyatomic is called hypochlorite. So here's the polyatomic, ClO. Ah, I identified this whole thing, so now the only thing left is to identify is the potassium. But if I go to the periodic table, potassium is right here. It's in group one. All of group one are metals except for hydrogen. So K is a metal. Now, here we go, we're gonna start naming. The metal name comes first because it's literally stated first and that name always stays exactly the same. So K, I'm just gonna write potassium. That's cool. And then now we have the polyatomic and that name always stays exactly the same. So you just gotta memorize them. Hypochlorite, it's gonna stay hypochlorite. Pretty simple. Now since ionic, just do like a double check. Do you need a Roman numeral in the middle? You only need a Roman numeral for elements that are transition metals. But since potassium is not in this block, this is where your transition metals are, you don't need one. So you're done. So K, C-L-O, is just potassium hypochlorite. And there you go. Thank you so much for viewing the video. I hope you guys are doing well. And let me know in the comments if this helped you out. And if you want to help us out, please press the subscribe button. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for that. And I will see you in all in the future lessons. Take care. See ya. Bye-bye.